Guys, does this look good? Does it? I don't know. Hello everyone. Um, yeah, this is me, Mr. Bean Cool, and I was I was just hoping that. Oh yeah, I was I was trying to um, to do some stuff, but you know that that didn't really work out because I had some complications where I was unable to make any video whatsoever. But what I want to show you is, uh, for this video, I am going to tell you beforehand that this video may creep you out because it's about ghosts. If you believe in ghosts and are terrified by them whatsoever, um, then skip to the timestamp, which, which is right in the screen. Yeah. And if you are not afraid of them or you just don't believe in them, then... It's up to you whether you want to skip this or not. Because these are about my own experiences. Um, I don't expect comments like ghosts aren't real, shut the up. No. If you do that, I'm going to remove your comment. Because um, I sound a bit rude now, I know. But I didn't ask about opinions whether ghosts exist or not. But aside of that, let's just get started. Also, I want to announce that... Um, right now I have it right open here. Wait a second, my cursor is in the way. So this is um, the quiet corner. It's a server I'm partner with. Or at least I'm trying to. <laughs> and basically the server has a lot to offer. It has like good content creators. Um, nice community. There's even a, uh, a, f a, a huge amount of uh, channels. Okay, maybe not that big, but it, it does have certain objects or topics you can talk about. Uh, no vent channels, because we can basically DM each other about that. Which is also a good al alternative, but if you don't like DMing, then... Yeah, I'm I'm always open to talk whatsoever, so... But aside of that, we also have, have a an art contest. In which the submissions... Oh my god. Okay, I, I really want to uh, to vote for this one. I don't know why. Uh, how do I vote? Maybe a... You know what, I'll just do an okay hand. This okay hand is me. Also, we're right now at 12 boosts. We need 8 more until we can reach... Fine, or until we... Can I please click? Until we finally reach level 3, which requires 20 boosts. If you're one of those 8 people who boosts our server... Um, and you choose to boost this one I will make sure that you will get a Nitro subscription for a friend of yours who doesn't have Nitro hang on and I'm not talking about the and I'm not talking about the classic Nitro which doesn't have server, bo server boosting on, but it does have chat perks no I'm not talking about this I'm talking about this Yes, the enhanced Discord experience for one low monthly cost. And you know what? Let's also add a year to it. Because I will gift a year to one of you guys. Those who don't, those who didn't get it and get through the giveaway, will get a month. And I do have to warn you, if this idea is not approved by people I know, then... It will be discontinued. But as far as I know, it will be continued. Which means I have to I have to give away 170 euros. Or dollars rather. But I don't but that's less than euros, so that's so I'll be good. I will likely do this when I when it's my birthday. So those who boosted and came from my video, please DM me. And I will give you a Nitro subscription, yes. And if you are willing to give this to a friend or yourself, if it if it runs out in two days after your boost, that's okay. Fun. That's okay too. But if you're if you're willing to give it to a friend, I'm I'm very sure that they will love your your gift. I I really am sure. One of you guys will will surely get a year for me for me. Whether it's to upgrade yourself or to give away, depends. That's pretty cool. Also, you may have noticed, I, I don't have, like, I don't have the Nitro yearly. 
upgrade to yearly and get two months free. What a deal! We're pro ready. If you join now, which of which the link is in the description below, um, I will first of all warmly welcome when you whenever you say something like at go go zoom me sixty four send me here please or or if you want to please I don't gonna mind which please give me pudding Mr being cool no wait I have an I have an idea there we go yeah so if you if you type okay if you send in this so if you just ping me then I will I will be sure to warmly welcome you and I will add you to the list of to the list of people I can give I can give the price of my way to. However, if you're the only one, like the actual only one in here who joins and no one else joins, then I'm gonna discontinue it. It's it's not that one person joins and they will immediately win. No, that's not the case. Um, at least two people have to join in order to make it uh, actually a giveaway. Anyway, guys, um, I was about to go, but then I realized, like, wait, I forgot something. Stories. Yeah. So, what is the story going to be? Well, first of all, again, um, okay, you know what? I, uh, I said this in the beginning, but I probably cut this out already. Because I, I often tend to cut out my own content. I tend to cut my videos so that... Uh, excuse me. But anyway, um, again, if you're afraid of ghosts or just don't want to deal with them whatsoever, just click in the timestamp below. Um, I know annotations aren't a uh, thing, so you got to search it up for yourself. But basically, um, a few years ago, I met a guy. And uh, his name I don't know anymore. Um, but this guy, he had like a, um, uh, yeah, he was in the neighborhood. But basically, there was a guy or a boy. And I think I mentioned this in my We Internet Friends video, uh, Spin Wheel Get Facts. But there was a boy who um no wait no i didn't i didn't tell this there no sorry because you you might you might think like oh wait Kun, you already told me about the ghost no it's not about a ghost yet <laughs> but it is about a haunted house because i know a guy in real life i knew him i don't know what happened to him but i haven't seen him in a while um and this is this is actually real this is actually in the netherlands i don't know the address for sure but i i can look it up one day basically this um this neighborhood the guy was in had an actual haunted house what's even worse is that the government there in his city was like let's sell this house because we need money and so they did. They actually sold the house to someone. Poor soul who had to deal with the house because it was an actual disaster on the outside and inside. I have never checked the inside before, but I can already imagine that it's actually pretty much a disaster. Anyway, basically the, uh, the house was sold without any reparation, repairs, whatever the term is. And it was just there. It was just for sale. It was just for sale, and someone actually bought it. Yeah. Now I don't know if the guy or girl or woman or whatever. I don't know if that person um, actually like uh, repaired the entire house before before living in there, because this house is actually a disaster. It wasn't even it wasn't even capable of living in. And yet they did sell it. I was enraged back then. Like, how the frick can they can they actually sell this to the public where no one can live in it? 
What purpose does it have other than just creepy Halloween decoration? I haven't noticed this house in a while. But it's somewhere in... It's somewhere nearby The Hague. I don't know where exactly. I'll actually look it up one day. I'll, I'll do actually... I will do actual research for, for you guys to find this house and see what the hell happened with it now. But this house is actually creepy. And there's another story from, from me where I encountered a ghost. Now, if you haven't watched it yet, you may have watched the uh, Spin Wheel Get Facts video with Kazi on the Weird Internet Friends channel. Now, here's the fun thing. This... Um, this video, um, I talked about how I met a boy in a library and he was walking circles around my table and then disappeared. Yeah, okay, so basically what I have, what I also have for a ghost story, with an actual ghost, is I was drawing in my room and uh, yeah, basically I was drawing in my room and I was looking at my uh, lamp. No, not the lamp on the ceiling, no. There was a table next to my bed, a bedside table. Logic. And there was a lamp standing on it. And I was like, let's, um, let's, let's think. And what happened was I saw a silhouette of someone above the lamp like their face had the light in them and when i looked it they were just gone they just, they just straight up disappeared i was like holy freak and i haven't really slept ever since especially knowing that the following weeks were only paranormal stuff in my room I was like, geez, my, ha my room is haunted. And luckily I was only there for therapy, but I really did feel like my room was haunted back then. Like, every time I entered my room, I felt so freaking negative. So, so sad. But here's the thing. The building I was in was only made in 2012. Maybe even 13. So how could it be haunted then? And that is something I won't bother you guys with. Uh, that's something I'd rather research myself. As, unless you're a friend of mine in real life. But I doubt that any of my friends will watch this. Especially knowing that I am pretty shy with when it comes to showing my real life friends my YouTube channel. I don't know why. I should have expected this. Anyway. Um, yeah, that's basically my Halloween stories. How long have I been recording? Hang on, let me check. I've been focusing on my desk. 21 minutes. Jeez. Okay. I guess I gotta add an app here then. Because I'm running out of time. So, yeah, guys. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to check out my, di or my, my Discord server. Wow. Check out uh, the Quiet Corner. The Discord link is in the description below. There we go. And also be sure to check out the We're Internet Friends call-up channel. It's a pretty cool channel. We upload weekly. Sorry, we upload almost daily. Every day there should be a new person or a one of the members uploading a uh, video. But that's almost every day. It often occurs, and don't be mad, but it often occurs that we can't... Uh, Make a video. But if that happens, we'll let you know. Or not really, but yeah, we'll try. Anyway, guys, uh, this was Miss Bingo. I can't even pronounce my name right. Wow. That is just. I am enraged. I am so freaking upset. You can't even believe me, I think, because I'm not even sounding upset. <laughs>